Hey there guys, what's up? I'm Mehul and I'm a master's student studying international business law at the Montfort University Leicester. Well, by nature I am somebody who heavily uses social media such that I class myself as being addicted to social media. So, in order to tackle my social media addiction, between the 16th and the 21st of January, I decided to join in with the Montfort University's Digital Detox. And today, I would like to share with you guys what I learned about my social media addiction and most importantly what I learned about myself over the six days that I spent unplugged from social media. So let's get started. Starting with the first day, I'm not going to lie, I actually found it very difficult um, especially because I'm somebody who tweets and snapchats all day to let people know what I'm up to. And naturally, on the first day, within the first hour, I was constantly reaching for my phone in my pocket. And what I decided to do was um, just uninstall all the social media apps so that way the distraction would be gone. Uh, but I did decide to keep WhatsApp mainly because it's the only way I sort of talk to people on a regular basis. But what I decided to do was cut down on the time I spent on WhatsApp. I don't know about everybody else but I have this really bad habit where I'm endlessly scrolling through social media platforms and constantly switching between different social media platforms as well and one thing that I do personally is before I go sleep at night I have this habit of checking through my social media feeds and my emails and all the rest and the hardest thing on the first day was not being able to check my social media feeds right before I slept um, and I don't know this was just very difficult for me. So on the second day, as soon as I woke up, um, again, I have a habit of checking social media um, as if it's my morning newspaper. It keeps me informed and up to date. And the hardest thing was that I couldn't check my social media. And the effect this had on me was that I felt almost unconnected. It felt as if I no longer knew what was going on in the world. However, not being able to check social media in the morning meant that I was able to get myself out of bed much quicker and get ready much quicker. So in my whole morning ritual, so to say, I saved myself a whole 20 minutes. Having gained all this extra time in the day, it meant that I now needed to plan my day. So I sat down and structured my day by making a list of all the tasks I wanted to complete um, on that day. Uh, this was mainly because during the digital detox, um, my original aim was to sort of increase my productivity, so to say. So during the social media detox, uh, DME both offered and suggested a whole host of activities that I could replace my social media time with. Um, and one of the activities that I decided to take up was reading. Now, I am somebody who enjoys reading but I couldn't really make much time for it before maybe because I was spending it all on social media and starting to read again for pleasure was something that I really enjoyed. At the end of January I had two deadlines of two assignments both 4,000 and 5,000 words each and this was a mammoth task and honestly I'm so glad that the digital detox happened in January because being off social media meant that I wasn't constantly distracted by notifications. After I had gotten over the initial urge of using social media my brain just started to get used to it and it did seem to get easier and as a result, I was just getting my work done faster, leaving me more time to do things I actually enjoy. So wrapping up my experiences, um, honestly, the digital detox helped recalibrate my digital life. Um, it made me appreciate the crazy amounts of time that I was spending on social media. It wasn't that I didn't miss social media. I actually missed it a lot especially because uh, being on the detox meant that I couldn't participate in online discussions or tweet about things I'm passionate about. And this really made me realize the value social media adds to my life. However, that being said, there are two changes um, I'm going to be making in my life. And the first one is that I'm going to refrain using social media as soon as I wake up and before I go to sleep at night. And secondly, I want to continue to make time for reading for pleasure uh, because it makes me feel relaxed and it sort of completes my day. 
So there you have it guys, those were my experiences of taking part in Demontfort University's Digital Detox. I really hope you enjoyed watching this video as much as I did making it and I shall see you on the next one.